Looking for answers that have never come, the family of a kind and generous young man speaks to Action 3 News about their loss. Somebody gunned down a Burke High School student in September while he was walking home. To this day, police have not arrested anybody for the murder of 16-year-old John Tavius Swift. Senior reporter Jake Wasikowski has the very latest. Jake? Craig, the teen was walking home from the bus stop as he had done many times before, but family says he was nervous that day in September because someone had threatened him. His family is still looking for answers. He wasn't no selfish kid. He looked out for everybody else if he could. I mean, his cousins, his brother, his sister. Though it's been a time filled with family, T'Challa Renfro says a big part of him is missing this holiday season. Photos and memories are all that's left of his son, John Tavius Swift. The generous kid who had a big smile and loved his friends and family was killed three months ago. It's like, I don't know, it just angers me knowing that somebody just basically getting away with taking my son's life for no reason. The afternoon of September 24th, Swift had only walked about three blocks from the bus stop before he was shot at 34th and Northridge Drive. He was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. No suspects have been identified and no arrests have been made. It's our kids that's dying out here behind nothing. Shoes, colors, neighborhoods, streets. It's, it's senseless. We don't own none of that. Renfro keeps his son's name close to him at all times. He hopes his criminal past isn't reflecting on his son's case in the eyes of authorities. But most, he'd like to see someone come forward with information to find the person who killed his son. It's not snitching no more. It's only snitching when you're involved with the crime and you get caught and you go tell on it. You know what I mean? That's snitching. When you know of information, that's helping. If it was one of your children or one of your loved ones, you would want, you would want it done for you, your loved ones. I heard from police a short time ago who say still no arrests have been made and no arrest warrants have been issued. If you have any information, call Crime Stoppers at 444-7867. You can remain anonymous and be eligible for a $25,000 reward. Now, detectives did stress no piece of information is too small and don't assume they already have that info. Reporting live in the News Center, Jake Wazikowski, KMTV Action 3 News.